Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to The Walking Dead on PS4. As usual my name is Mike, otherwise known as The Gadget Addict, and with me is my lovely wife Emma. Say hello. She's, she's waving uh, and <laughs> providing the usual sarcastic advice. Uh, we're going to jump straight back in here. We're still in the drugstore. Uh, we have to find the pills for the guy that Kenny just punched out and he stressed himself into a minor cardiac arrest and no doubt shit's going to hit the fan again. Let's get back into it. Let me get through an office. Um, that's not the way. I really hope you're all enjoying this series. Uh, I very much am. Emma's a little bit nonplussed about it at the minute. Because she thinks it's slow. Is that a door? There we go. Alive inside. I've got a cat on me. Ow, ow, Claude. Ah, Clementine's coming with me. So what have we got in here? I have a feeling this is obviously where Lee worked after he was like, oh. I can't think about them in here. Can't think about what in here? First aid kit. Okay, we'll pick that up. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Look at... Ali. What's going on outside? This door leads to the back alley. Okay, so we can actually look at the alley. So look at the first aid kit. zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you really had. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. <laughs> I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Yada. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <clears throat> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. <clears throat> Okay, here we go. Seems rather stoic for a child. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Uh. What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. <laughs> All right, go further. She's not stupid, this kid. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? <clears throat> complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. 
But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Indeed, let's get this done. Another high drama little sequence there. Ow! Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. Hey, why not? There's a comedian first aid kit over there. I'll find you a bandage. It was there, it was. No, hang on, what's up there? Can you get the remote for that thing in here someplace? Yeah, you're more interested in finding the fucking telly remote than you are helping the little girl. Let's have a look at that finger. Now. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? How do I feel bad about lying to it? the remote to my dad's TV. Let's use the remote on that and see what it does. That's what I figured. Dad told me he bought that TV to watch baseball in here, but I caught him watching his stories more than a few times. Anything else at Clementine? How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Uh, I'm Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? <laughs> well, I'm not gonna go looking for him. I mean... Get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Alright, let's go through here. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. So where could they possibly be? That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Now this is one thing I remember not liking about point and click adventures, reaching a brick wall. Yeah, I see, I've already seen this bit of dialogue. Like one of the most hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Protect him, at least. Found the fool. There's a photo over there. Lee's family. Find anything? <clears throat> Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. And there you go, there's the backstory. Did you tell anyone time. out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No, I'm not sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. 
because if this lasts longer than a few days and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Okay then. Backstory filled in. So she's gonna have something to say about this. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. You would think she would have something to say about that, overhearing that. Maybe she's not as smart as I gave her credit for. Now where could the key possibly be? Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Um... He said yes. Yeah, he was. And you had to protect yourself. That's right. Oh, okay. I know it's a game, but I'm feeling very bad for lying to her. This shouldn't happen. It's a fucking game. Uh, he said something about behind the counter. What's that? Yeah, fucking hell, man. Uh, it's Clementine. What are you going over there for, Looks mate? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Hey there, uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee, <laughs> what's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do... Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Still need to work out what we're going to do about this guy with a heart attack. I don't know if that's, so they're supposed to be behind the counter, which would... That's Clementine. just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. There's nothing in there. Can I... There's no way I can swing the camera around, is it? What's that? I think an inventory of things here. I'm picking up these things, but I don't know what the fuck I'm actually doing with them. The pills are in there. Well, that is helpful. Right, so that's the door into there. Okay, so I'm just like picking things Try up. Try to get here. some rest, huh? How can I with those things out there? Hey, Lee, maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. <laughs> Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway. We, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Are you guys all right? We're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. 
What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They, uh, own this place. They're, uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. Okay then. So we found this damn key. Charles has not been bitten. So I'm melted now. <clears throat> How are we doing? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. Maybe he changes too. It's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Yeah, so that's the one I've been picking up. Sweet. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Um, okay. What's up there? Pictures. No pictures of Lee? Harsh as fuck. Even the black sheep of the family deserves a picture or two. Who are you? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Sure. Let's go no, have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Okay, so what's happening now? This isn't going to help me get the key, is it? Jesus. Oh, lovely. I can tell him I care about And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Who? Nope. That place is full of TVs and electronics. Look, and he's a remote control on them. That place is full of TVs and electronics. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. It's a combination lock. Don't know what that does. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. You can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power's still on. <laughs> you can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. You fucking sad, sir. 
Well fucking done, Doc. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Okay. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. They're gonna break the glass. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. <coughs> Lovely. Did you guys try All to right, get yeah, there same dialogue. Get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. Do wish you could skip this. A bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. All right. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I feel like I've got to break that window somehow. Sesame. That won't work. <laughs> I was kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doc. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification. Right, so I've already seen that there. one. Yeah, it didn't work. So what am I missing? The gun store. TVs. Combination lock. Those TVs are on. And I'm sure they're making a lot of noise. I need something to throw. Oh, man. Yeah. I can't reach that brick. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. <laughs> so there's a brick. There's a combination lock. It's doing what locks do. Clearly doing what locks do. So what the fuck am I missing here? Right. So I need to get over to that body over there. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. Ah, yes, the cane. Thank you. A few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. Bill, can you just repeat yourself? I don't even understand him. Uh, Let's go head back inside. Okay. Get the cane, I can get the brick, I can bash the lock, I can throw the brick. Bash the lock. How the hell do I get out? I've got to get out to search the guy. There's an exit to back alley. No, Clementine's deciding to follow. Where's the can? That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Are on that zombie out on the street. First aid kit, bed. I can't even see the damn door. How you doing? Okay. Okay, so the cane is not the answer because I can't seem to find it. It's on the desk, wasn't it? That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for yeah. Larry there. So the cane is clearly not the answer. So maybe I have to talk to people. Maybe somebody does know the combination. Ooh, 
Ooh, it's always nice getting stuck in a point and click adventure. Um, can't talk to you. Talk to you. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you! <laughs> yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? Never mind. I'm sure he's a good guy. He is. He just has his issues. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh. You guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. I'm gonna get back to him. So you do that. Until let's give him a chocolate bar as well. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's uh really sweet. Don't mention it. Hey. Oh, Carly is. Yeah. I'm gonna get back to him. She Sounds did. good. You do that. So where's Carly? She's around the corner. No, oh, that's new. Couldn't start that before. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. No, oh, it's just a cash machine. Uh, food bin. There we go. Seen that? Seen that? Talk. Let's give you a chocolate bar as well. Here. Be well, patronized as possible. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? Oh, uh, yeah, she might, I suppose. Yeah, give it to her. I can take care of myself. Okay. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Now you're suddenly now no electronics. Let me guess, no batteries. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> no. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Batteries! <laughs> hey, Carly. Now he's got his flirting face on.
You ready to head out? You got it. You? Shall I do this side of it, or...? What if the old man dies? Hmm. There's nothing else... I, there's no key in here. There's no... Nothing I can open yeah. it with. Let's go. So we'll see where this takes us.